What's that from? Uh, Ghost in the Shell. Oh, I haven't uh. seen that shit because I'm a bad weeb. You're a bad weeb. I know. Turn That's in your why weeb I card. said it. I listen. <laughs> I've listen. I make up for it in other other areas. I still very much deserve it, but not like for good reasons. For <laughs> like, it's for, like, sh- it's, it for, for sh- it, it's for like shitty Naruto fan fic- fiction reasons. Oh Raymond. shit! <laughs> Guess what? Quarantine made me stress re- like go back in time to. I was like, I, oh, I can imagine because I went back in time as. Oh, oh, where'd you go? Man. What'd you do? Oh, don't you don't it? make don't make I, me say you it. You gotta share with the class. Hey, we're recording. The whole internet wants to know. Tell me. <laughs> Actually, I went back and uh, I don't know if any of you guys were fans of like Lord of the Rings fan fiction, but yes. I went back and I've been rereading the Melon Chronicles. Oh my god! Oh. What I year just, is it? Uh, Judging from when I started reading them, about 2005. 2005? <laughs> yeah. Well, don't make me. I, as a gift. fully grown adult, have begun new Naruto role plays during quarantine because that's where I'm at. That's mentally. fair. It's like fair. I was like, I'm just gonna dive head deep back into this smutty, dumb world full of ninjas. Oh god. And it's been fun. Now, does anyone remember where we left off? I know, Havoc, you got your passport. Or were you... We went to the Friendship Cafe. We went to the Friendship Cafe, and we all got a dinner, and we got farsighted dinner, so we could all eat it on the boat together. Mm-hmm. Right, right. Mm-hmm. Yep, and we were... I was not given my passport. Instead, I was given a task oh, that's to right. before I get my passport. Yeah. I had to track down and kill a hellhound. Casual, just a very normal mission. Right. I should mention uh, the Hellhound is in the city. Yeah. Um, well, that's convenient. And it's not like there's a specific Hellhound specifically terrorizing specific people. It's just like kill a Hellhound just... to show that you care. <laughs> if anything, we care too much, so we'll kill two Hellhounds. <laughs> we'll kill it twice. I really don't. We'll kill it twice is dead. I really don't think you want to do that. No, we won't. Good. Because Chatterbox is probably going to see that hellhound, and I don't know what they look like. They're probably terrifying, but I guarantee you she's going to go, (gasps) Puppy! (laughs) (laughs) Fortunately, we have Havoc, who is enough of a puppy. Listen, all dogs are puppies, even the ugly, monstrous ones. (laughs) I mean... There's a Seattle street gang called the 405 Hellhounds. Are there 405 of them? That's very specific, yeah. What happens if they want to recruit? Uh, They gotta kill one of the old ones. Yeah. Okay. Oh, shit. Nice. Or, you know, maybe they just... They lose so many every now and then, and they're like, I guess... I guess as one dies, they'll recruit. They're like, we gotta keep it at 405. Specifically. So as soon as one's out new guys in. There's probably a wait list. If they're smart. They're a street gang. How smart can they be? Ah! It's pretty... You can be pretty smart and in a gang. Oh, excuse you. Yeah, it, it depends on which gang you're dealing with and what level of which gang. Because, like, your individual Halloweener is pretty stupid. Yeah. But the Halloweeners as a gang, very well organized. Very well organized, but- very scary, and they have professional mafia backing. Yeah. Really not a big fan. They're all right. I, say. I mean, they-, they suck, but they're all right. Oh, no. They, mm-hmm. Like, they should. They, you should not be a fan. You should be scared. Eh. Okay. Chatterbox has seen and dealt with enough gangs in her life. She's from Poil Up. <laughs> Fear seems like way too reasonable a response from you. So. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> She's just like, I know, right? That would be the only logical decision, so obviously that's not what I'm gonna do. Alright, got my rule book open, I got my street grim- grimoire, oh, also, ready to fucking party. 
Farsight, I know that I bought yes. them for you, but I don't know if I ever officially gave you the jammer pieces to repair your jammer. Uh, I, figured... I, I remember you doing that, and I did write it down, so we do Perfect. have that. Yeah, I will I just... be working on that. Perfect. And, and all kinds you. of presents. Thank yeah, I thought, that. well, I figured it would be useful for all of us, and also I felt really bad when Nighthawk just smashed it in front of everybody. Ah, these things happen. I know, but it was a little sucky, and I was, you know, I was with somebody who had jammer parts, and I was like, you got jammer parts? And she was like, yeah, so then I was like, alright, give them to me, and then there you go. Yep, and then there was a jammer. And then there I, was a jammer. I, I look forward to using it. That, I look we forward to that thing. I, I, that's why I brought it up in case I forgot to bring it up last time. Was I was like, we might want that before we go out and do more things. Yeah, I'd probably prioritize fixing the jammer first and then uh, adjusting the uh, passport that I found. Our yeah. SIM card. So, oh, okay. uh, how long would you say the jammer would take to fix? Oh, not too long. You could probably you could do it on the ferry ride back. Perfect. I pull it out. Oh, I start working. Fuck and me. I have some tasty beef. Um, but say, it's real. Mmm, um, tasty. So it's, uh, I, I showed mm, you yeah, we're all like slowly jizzing our pants while eating like a fourth of a filet mignon. <laughs> yeah. And we're all like, oh my god. Painkiller's passed out on the floor. Yeah, just in a food coma. Yep. Yes. Too much real protein. <laughs> right? We've been eating so much soy that our bodies... We probably have, like, minor inflammation because our joints are like, what the fuck? You don't process food anymore, bitch. <laughs> or you don't process meat, at least. I'm about to say, soy's, soy's got protein. That's why soy is good. No, I just meant meat, you know? Yeah. Like the real stuff. I haven't eaten real meat in, like over a year and now when I try to eat like pork I like I'm like why do my feet hurt? <laughs> Cuz it gives me fucking arthritis. That's why. <laughs> Have you tried Sorry. not having arthritis? <laughs> I've tried. I've been trying for like a year <laughs> havoc. <laughs> uh -uh. I'm sorry, that's that's all the health advice I've got. <laughs> I know. All right. So we're on a boat. Our sights jamming out. About Chatterbox that. is probably clamming out. I think interpret that how you want. I think that um, the passport lady did give us a rough area that we should be searching in for the Hellhound. Mm. But did she give us specific directions or like vague mystic cues? I think she said somewhere in this area, but I didn't write down the area. Oh no, oh. Uh, she suggested to look uh, someplace downtown. <laughs> okay. Rena, thank you for that. Those are so cute. Yeah, let's hit up downtown. I haven't been to, I haven't been downtown in forever. Downtown. You were there literally a few days ago. Shh. That's forever in Shatterbox's mind. That's true. When you're, she was when like, "When that, is yesterday?" When you're on Charm Chalk, fucking yeah, then... yeah. When she just hopped up on Charm Chalk, she's like, "When is yesterday? Where am I?" What year is it? Yeah. <laughs> Why yeah. do my teeth itch? <laughs> <laughs> uh, you guys get off the ferry, and uh, you you're you're already in downtown, but now you can uh, hang out around downtown. Oh my god. Uh, well, down, downtown's basically got three sides. West side, east side, and central. And then you go east of that, and you go to the arcology. And you go south are there of any, that, and you go to Redmond. Are there any, like, specific themes to each side? Like, one's a shopping district, one's a business, blah, 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 or um, just all loose? Things nanny. get more business-like when you go east, as, right, fuck east um, then. as people try to like siphon business off of the uh, off of the arcology. It's like, oh, mm. hey, you could go to the arcology to buy some cyberware mm. or some deck programs, or, or you could come to my shop that sells. You could come to the discount hut. Right. You could yeah you could come to my place and buy some nerfs. 
Um, nerps. Nerps. Yeah, what were nerps again? Is it nerps uh, or nerps? New exciting. Oh, something. Retail product. Product. I think it was retail product or something like that. I net have to enhancements. Page. Oh wait, net enhancements. New exciting Shadow retail Run. product. Damn it, that's not it. <laughs> New exciting retail products. Jesus. Never Christ. eat raw pasta. Got it. Nerf. Crunch. <laughs> Crunch. Adverts for NERPs are generally vague, ambiguous, and contradictory as their exact nature or purpose. They're stand ins for the latest trendy consumer product. So, like Tamagotchis, Pogs, Pet Rocks, cell phone faceplates, kale chips, fidget spinners, that sort of thing. Nice. Just whatever cool. is hot and trendy. Right. But Cap got it right when he said. They could come up with a sign for each one, but why waste the neon? Right? Everything's getting busted out, like, every other day nowadays. Exactly. Um, consider how consider how short the cultural cycle is now. It It's only going to get Multiply quicker. Multiply it. Yeah. Like, your, your new jam, the new MMO you and your friends have been playing, that shit was obsolete when you opened up the box, idiot. Mm. Uh, but yeah. <clears throat> Uh, east side's generally got more more shops um and you can also find some uh magic shops and talismongers over there uh, which you can't find inside the arcology um just because um most mm, like magic and uh corporations don't mix so well right especially this close to uh, a sort of uh, a magical homeland so to speak Mm. Um, if you were in Vegas, like uh, you'd be buying, uh, you'd be buying as technology talismans. Mm -hmm. Just don't think about where they came from. And you know, uh, you can go to the Bioware, you can go to the Evocorp, Evocorp Bioware Emporium, or you can go outside of the Arcology and just go to Little Chibas. Yeah. Loves I'm picking up Chibas. what you're putting down. Yeah, you're like, I could go to the Arcology and get top notch, or I could save a little many and get eh notch. Exactly. Yeah, I feel I feel Functional you. Functional notch. Yeah. Uh, still have food for later notch. <laughs> or still have grocery money for later notch. Um uh, central downtown is more uh sort of like luxury oriented. That's where you got the mm -hmm. nightclubs and the restaurants mm -hmm. and uh, occasionally there's a fixer's place uh this is where shadow runners meet and convene it's also where the gang hangs out there is one gang in downtown the i fivers an all elf gang okay that's not entirely mm. true there are a bunch of gangs all over the place you know four guys hustling down an alley that's a gang but the i fivers they've almost gone pro man yeah, uh, they're like legit, legit. Somebody give me an intuition and gang identification or gang. Oh, I role. have perks in those things. Uh, Shut up! I'm happy. No good. <laughs> Go for it. And the west side is more corporate. If you're not good enough to get into the arcology, you have yeah. Set up a uh, you set up an office west side. West side if is I snapped also that, where. Sorry, I apologize. I apologize if I snapped. I thought that woo was a sarcastic. Oh, it's okay. I didn't think and, uh, uh, back too hard. Not uh, too yeah. hard, but I think it was misplaced. Uh, intuition and, like, any appropriate gang knowledge. Unfortunately, cool. you will not get your home field advantage. Fine. Uh, Can I add my... Can I add my uh, Halloweeners uh, knowledge to this? You can. Well, I add half of your Halloweeners knowledge. Okay. Just because the particular factoid I'm thinking of does relate to them. And the okay. seated rivalry. Uh, nothing. Burp. Should I, I call, should I call my successes successes or hits? Will that fuck you up? Um, I prefer Does you it call not them matter? Hits? Cool. Okay. What should I call my ones? Just ones? Um, you don't need to call out your ones unless you glitched or critically glitched. Gotcha. Oh, okay. Cool. Good to know. You just need to count them. 
And a regular glitch is when you have more than your successes, but a critical glitch is all ones, right? Um, let me look it up just to make sure. Glitches! Yes. Double check. I keep getting close to thinking that I know what it is, and then I'm like, oh, maybe it's wrong. If more than half of the dice you rolled are a one. What? Gotcha. Oh, fuck that. I don't like that. If you rolled more ones, then you rolled successes. Okay. Um, that sounds fun. And a critical glitch is if everything's a one. Home oh, no. rules, baby. It, no, my bad. Uh, critical glitch is if you did not achieve a hit, but more than half of your pool is ones, that's a critical glitch. Gotcha. Okay, that makes sense. Let me write that down in, so I can don't have to ask that question again. Sounds good. <laughs> also, you can buy hits if you don't feel like rolling. Of course, that means you'll do definitely do worse than you would have if you rolled, statistically speaking. I can buy hits? Yeah, like with so new like, yen? No, so like uh, if you don't want to roll and you're just like, you know what, I'll take an audible on this one. You can mm. turn four dice into a hit. Oh, interesting. Cool. Uh, rounding down. So if you have nine dice, that's only two hits. And if you have five dice, that's only one hit. Interesting. But Ooh. if you're doing something really easy and you're like, do I have to roll? Uh, I can be like, well, how many dice do you roll? You'd be like, I roll 16 dice on this. And I'll be like, okay, never mind. You're good. Thanks, Havoc. Uh, that being said, if you're under duress or like something really funny might happen if you fuck it up, I will make you roll. <laughs> Oh, that cheat sheet's for me, not you. Oh. Well, but uh, you're welcome. <laughs> I just saw a, cheat, I saw a cheat sheet, and I was like, perf. And then I opened it up, and I was like, I don't think this is what I needed. No, it's for me. <laughs> oh, this is well, well, thank you to you, then. <laughs> it's going to make my life so much easier. <laughs> I was about to say, did you pin that? Yes. Oh, thank goodness you have admin privileges. Oh, who gave me those? That guy's a genius. I know, right? Uh, anyway, uh, Chatter, what did you get? Uh, I got three hits. Ha. Uh, you do know, number one, that the I-Fivers and the Halloweeners have a deep-seated rivalry. Mm, They've been duking history. it out over control of the city for 50 years at this point. Like, mm -hmm. two generations of this gang have died. That's honestly really impressive for any gang in Seattle to survive a generation. Much less two. Definitely. Um, and you you do know... Uh, well, uh, Painkiller, you know that the wieners are backed by the Mafia. <laughs> and so, because you know this, Chatterbox, you know this. And because you know the wieners are backed by the Mafia, you get a distinct impression that the I-Fivers need to have some sort of greater, deeper crime backing them. Crime organization backing them as well. Sorry, a really loud car just went by my house. That's okay. I just was like, I don't know what that It wasn't was. a car. It was a motorcycle. Uh, ah. That explained it. I was like, what is swelling in, like, volume? What is crescendoing in the background? It's, um, I hired them to come by every uh, hour or so to it enhance the atmosphere. It sounded like a ghost was haunting someone, and I was like, are we all about to witness somebody just, like, <laughs> fucking, like, paranormal activities dying? <laughs> We're all just on the like, other side of the mic. Yeah, we're it's like, PK, be the next... PK, you there? Oh, what happened to PK? <laughs> I've got some bad news. It's definitely Derek that's going to get killed by this terrible spirit. Oh, shit! <laughs> yeah, that tracks. Aw, yeah. oh, Derek. <laughs> bad, bad news, buddy. <laughs> you, know, you know the ghost or demon or monster is going to come after you. We have to protect Derek. <sighs> Protect Derek 2020. So, okay, so we know the i fivers must have something. Right. Is gotcha. this important right now? No. I just wanted to gauge yeah. how much you knew about the biggest gang in downtown. Oh, yeah. Listen, as somebody who has specific skills in... We cannot hear we you. We cannot hear you, Far Farsight. I was wondering why you've been so quiet. Try disconnecting and reconnecting. Give it the old off and on trick. Have you it tried turning it off and sometimes. The old flicker treatment. Okay, it appears oh, there we go. Returned. There we go. I noticed, I noticed my my name wasn't lighting up, so I'm like, wait, are they not hearing me? <laughs> yeah, no. when we were like taunting you, I was like, oh, Firestart is just fucking taking it over here. 
Yeah, I had some good Ghostbuster quotes, but now they're gone. <laughs> no, you can no. give them to us and post if you want. Nah, it's just not the same. Mm. <laughs> Fair. Huh. Okay, so... The what? Sons of Sauron. It's an orc gang. Oh, good it's lord. Not... Okay. They're all uh, fucking nerds. They are. Nerds. I hate those guys. Oh, no. The nerds have taken over the world. That, like, when, when dragons and elves were real, the nerds were like, <laughs> our time has come! <laughs> no, but we're calling them nerds like they're the new nerds. Like, they're just <laughs> Like, I'm gonna cool shove them in a locker. Yeah. Like, they could... They could have been nerds once upon a time or not, but they are nerds now. Because we have deemed them so. Um, what is the west side of the downtown lake? Uh, west side is, uh, more corporate. Offices. Oh, okay. Th there are a couple of restaurants and okay. stuff, but that's mostly cool. where, uh, wage slaves go to blow off steam. Also, cool. west side is where Lone Star lives. Ooh. Right, I fun. should mention, when you guys are in downtown, you're in a security rating, at, you're in an A-ranking security mm. zone. Uh, Lone Star response is two minutes. Okay, so we'll try not to. You can do a lot with others. two minutes. Oh, you can do a lot with That's two minutes and like twenty rounds. You can do. suck like five dicks in two minutes. Jesus Christ! <laughs> what kind of fling are well. you? <laughs> uh, on that note, I'm gonna grab some water real quick. But uh, everybody else, feel free to disperse amongst the downtown if they yeah, want. I'm gonna grab some bleach. Oh, Hail Hydra. okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna grab some. I'm gonna grab some bleach real quick, and I'm gonna fucking drown my sorrows. I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, good lord! Also, I found this map of the United States. Oh shit! Or what it looks like now. Right. Nice. Wait, is this the one with uh, Seattle on the right side of the coast or the left? <laughs> it, it, this one has Seattle on the west side. Nice. Uh, that being said, uh, Seattle in that little area is still controlled by the USAS, even though Salashai took the rest of the uh, area. Oh, this is a nice map. Yeah. That, I... Huh. Okay. <laughs> well, what's up? I did not spell Tear Tangier correctly. That's okay. It's Elvin. Or, or Salashai. <laughs> Cap, do you speak Sparethial? No, but I'm working on it. Um, also, let me... I don't even know what language Salashai is. Uh, but I can look it up. Ooh, the capital is Bellingham. Um, uh, We're yeah, surrounded by interesting fangs. My bad. The language is Salish. <laughs> All right, great. <laughs> uh, ostensibly, Salishide means home of the shallot. I'm sorry, home that of the Salish. This is so cool. Oh, my bad. Uh, Tear Tangier isn't in Salishide. The Sin Sirarch is in Salishide. <laughs> Pardon me. Uh, Tear Tangier is to the south. But you get the point. There be elves in them thar hills. Hmm. Huh. Apparently, Seder Krupp has a heavy uh, influence, has a ca heavy corporate presence in uh, Salashide. Hmm. I, but I mean, what do you? What could you possibly do without Seder Krupp? Uh, is it Macro Technologies? Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, what the fuck? Uh, heavy Industries. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, Cap, could you give me a quick German on this? Because I did just oh, say yeah. it real quick, because I can't. Yeah, let me, um... 
Wow. Äh, Schwer, Schwerindustrie Gesch Gesellschaft. Is that also, a word? So, yes, it is. Um, wow. Industry <laughs> Science. Uh, I will dissect that word for you. Thank you. Is it like one condensed sentence? Because it almost looks. Schwerindustrie Gesellschaft. Well, the way it's German me. works, if you want to add more word, if you want to add more, it's a compound word. Yeah, if you want to add more meaning onto a word, you just start slamming words together. Oh, okay. It, it basically so, means make a chord. Schwer in Gesellschaft. <laughs> It means mega corporation. Industry Gesellschaft is industrial company, and Schwer means large. I'm so glad. I'm so glad that I came in to the middle of this. Is this another company we're learning about? No, it's a classification of company. I was like, please don't make me write this down. No, you're fine. Okay, this won't be on the test later. It'll be on the personal test that I will give you, yes. Oh, ah! apparently recently Lofweer repurchased all of his shares in Seder Krupp. He now has a 100% share count. Uh, that's so he just lot. owns all of... Okay. That's a Interesting. Lot. Does he even bother having, like, a CEO council? or What council? He is the council. 100% is a lot. I mean, are you going to argue with the fire-breathing dragon? I didn't fucking think so. Statistically uh, speaking, it's a lot. It was my understanding that years ago, he would partition out his share count by, like, fractions of percentages of points, but I guess he got those all back. Dragons be like that, man. I guess he doesn't want Dragons to Dragons be like that. On whatever he's yeah, got. he just sleeps on the bell spawns. <laughs> anyway, you're downtown. Right, west Woo. side is mostly corporate, small-time corporations. Let me see if I can find a list of uh, AA corporations. Excuse me. Bless you. Oh, second act. Excuse me again. <laughs> I don't know why, but I've been naming my burp through acts lately. I'm like, first act, burp. <laughs> if I get a three-act play, that's how you know it's Shakespeare level. Oh, come on. Give me those corporations. Hey, here we go. Um... Give it to me, baby. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I was like, don't make me do it all by myself. I would never. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Um... What can oh, I say? Man. I'm reliable. Mitsuhama hit it big. Shit. Right. Have I, have I stipulated which uh, mega corporations have made it into the arcology? Because I know, uh, I know you uh, a little bit. You may have whilst we were at the arcology, but if you want to go over it again, I'll pay more attention. I'm about to say, uh, I'm locking it in. Scott's lock of the week. <laughs> it's going to be Evo, Mitsuhama Computer Technologies. Oh, that's and, right. And um, I'm going to go with Wujing just to... Um, just to throw in some uh, some more sort of foreign flavor, um, but I tell you what, Mitsuhama, they bowed their time. Uh, they um, they were they used to be set up in West Side a couple decades ago, but after the Thon incident, they moved right into the Arcology. That being said, they're not too keen on the fact that they're sharing it with two other megacorps. It used to be sometimes that sharing is caring. But uh, after after the whole meltdown, um, uh, Mitsuhama was you know quick to get there. Wu Zheng came in right behind, and then Evo also muscled their way in. Um, Good for you, Evo. We love an underdog. Uh, uh, unfortunately, yeah, neither one unless of them they're has... assholes. In case no, <laughs> unfortunately, none of them <laughs> have been able to gain an upper hand. Ooh. Hey, listen, you know what's better than a monopoly? An oligarchy. Three monopolies. But only, but only <laughs> slightly. It gives you more quote-unquote options. I, have I love having quote-unquote choice. choices. <laughs> and quote-unquote 
pretty dumb. <laughs> What's uh, that? Freedom? God, God, who knows what that is anymore? We've all forgotten. Yeah, there was. Freedom is having two futons there. and a landlord who doesn't ask for rent because you know too much on him. That actually <laughs> does sound like That's freedom. freedom. Yeah, yeah, that right? sounds pretty good. Yeah, it's not bad. My bad. Uh, police response. I'm sorry. Lone Star response is 1d6 minutes in downtown. If you end up on West Side, it's uh, uh, elongated to 1d6 plus four minutes. Mm. Uh, that being said, if you didn't make too much noise, you can possibly uh, jump ship to another district. Such I mean, Redmond, we won't we Redmond. won't start any trouble unless it's how hellhound trouble, right, guys? Right. I mean, that's still technically yeah. trouble. I, it I is. think that it would fall under illegal discharge of firearms. What if we're shooting at a at a hellish hound? Yeah. Are um, are hellhounds a protected species? Yeah, um, that's the question. That's a good question. I actually would like to ask you for some information on hellhounds, considering mm. I have a uh, interest in parazoology. Ooh, yeah, that get that parazoology, par boo. <laughs> roll that logic and parazoology footage. Yes, Havoc. Yes, Havoc always, but right now, here, sir. That'll be one hit. One hit. Um, you do know that they're not endangered. Um, hellhounds are, um, are interesting. Um, we love interesting. Yep, I went too far. I went too far. I dug too deep. It's basically a meta species of German Shepherd. Um, oh. We're shooting a dog? Oh, yeah. We, just yeah. a regular dog? No, or like an not evil a dog. It is not a regular dog. Okay. Um, uh, hellhounds are larger and they have a magic score. Oh. Their magic have score is five. Fires. Holy fuck! Yeah. Is that high? Yes. Yes? That's one that less high. than me. Oh! Holy shit! <laughs> magic puppy! <laughs> okay. Like, oh my god, it's it's magic dog versus magic dog fight! I've been waiting my whole life! Like, the I highest mean... magic score is, like, a dragon, which has ten. Nice. So Chatterbox, that's... like, grabs Havoc by the shoulder and is <laughs> like, This is your destiny! Magic I mean, dog I, versus magic dog. This was meant to be havoc. I really don't want to kill it, but if it is rampaging all over the place, it kind of has to be done. Uh, Listen, are, it sounds like fate. <laughs> hellhounds are basically just big fire-breathing wolves. Yeah, I don't right. feel bad. Explain like, this. I feel like if we're shooting at that and the Lone Stars come up and they're like, what the fuck? We'll be like, uh, fire-breathing dog? And they'll be like, oh, that makes sense. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. How do people train them? Uh, How are they normally kept in check? Uh, the same way that you train a dog. Mm -hmm. uh, treats, uh, uh, carrot, and stick. Um, do, do any of my charisma skills work against, like, lower animals? Uh, how much... Uh, there is an animal handling skill. No, There's an animal handling skill. I don't have any I of that. Have it. I hoping I could persuade the dog... <laughs> You usually have to, if I remember correctly, I might be talking out my ass. You have to combo animal handling with parazoology to be able oh. to interact with magical creatures. Well, with any then success. Chatterbox is going to leave that talking to you, Havoc. Oh, boy. <laughs> handling Chatterbox hellhounds. will just be moral support. Handling hellhounds is particularly difficult. Um... They're smarter than regular dogs, and they know it. Mm. Um, yeah. They, they know how magical and badass they are? Yeah. Gotcha. Uh, I mean, if you're going to be that badass, you better know it. Oh, uh, they can also see in the dark. Damn. Uh, they're also dual-natured, which means they can perceive the astral as readily as you perceive the material. Oh, yeah. neat. Fuck. Um, I think Chatterbox knows what she wants to do once we're ready to explore downtown. But if anybody else wants more info until then. Uh, do they have any particular weaknesses? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, it is just like a large dog that breathes fire. All right. I didn't know if like dumping a bucket of water would be helpful. No, 
Dumb. Okay. You you know for a fact that that is not helpful. Oh, also they're fast. Jesus Christ, they're fast. Um, it's said that vampires have a strange relationship with hellhounds, but uh, it's a well kept secret in the in the undead uh, living space. Then I will take cap the player. We'll pocket that away, but. My character shall not. Okay. Well, it... Mm, mm. We should be able to track where it's going. Yeah? Go for it. Um... I, I leave the negotiating with animals, and Chatterbox does, like, a big flourished bow, like, to you, my good friend. I would normally, uh want to negotiate with, with this creature, but um, I think that that should be plan B. I'm going to put that down to plan D, but you know, you, you, you can orient your plans wherever you want. Now the trick is finding one. Yeah. Because it's so magical, would it leave a sort of trace in places where it's been it would lead uh, an astral chase how many ranks do you have in a sensing um none but i do have decent points in tracking unfortunately Ooh. a sensing is what you use to follow astral trails okay uh, you could follow its physical trails for tracking uh, that being said, fi figuring out where to begin your investigation is at this point the hard part. Yeah. yeah I actually have level one tracking. Oh, you can help. Yay! Fantastic. If only you could find where someone was horrifically burned alive and had chunks of them missing. I mean, we could poke our heads into a couple of street docks. It's not a bad place to start. It's not a bad place to start at all. Let's see. And the tracking goes. Oh, uh, one hit. Oh, and one, one, yet. And no, one valve. You don't oh. have a trail to follow. You have no trail. Oh. Sorry, I thought we had found something. Nope. <laughs> a little confused, but he's got the spirit. <laughs> Yay. Uh, so, um... Any hey, Chatter, you want to work your magic? I mean, you could, yeah. you could also, like, I don't know, go to an act, go to Seattle General and try to sweet talk a nurse. Yeah, that's we, also a great we idea. Do whatever we want to do. Then again, it'll probably be easier to get information out of someone who like doesn't have a medical license. Yeah, I can get information out of anybody. Not any like no nope. anybody who's nobody. You know what I'm saying? Those are the only people. As someone matter. who's nobody, I get what you're saying. Yeah, I'm best friends with anybody who's nobody. All those anybody's, I don't fucking know them. <laughs> All right, let's, <laughs> let's get this started. We're on yeah, a let's... bit of a time crunch. Yeah, let's go. All right. So, street docs or some other medical establishment? I mean, I've got, well, any other medical establishment or just one in downtown? A one in downtown. Okay, that makes sense. Because I was like, well, I've got a guy, but he's far away. <laughs> yeah, there, there are uh, too many hellhounds and pull you up. Too many let's pools. hit the street docks. I've got street speak and all kinds of fucking shit. Sweet, sweet. Let's uh, go. Make and I've a... got some skills in medicine, so when they start talking to me, I might actually know what they're saying. Uh, make a... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, make a... Uh, where is it? There it is. Make a charisma and etiquette roll. Oh, I would love to. That's ten for me, baby. <laughs> Ooh, not great. Not terrible. Ooh. Um... Two successes. Um, you, you, you chat with a couple of, you know, board teens, um, and they, yeah, uh, they point you in the general uh, direction of someone who does, in fact, claim to be a doctor. 
Awesome. Um, let me see if I can. Let's go to this. Let's go talk to this. Might be a doctor. Those are my favorite kinds. That's my favorite kind when I'm not actually hurt. Well, yeah. Duh. And we're not actually hurt, so. Yeah. Perfect time. Hmm. Um. Let me see. I mean, you know, uh, you know, uh, Doc Buzzsaw down there, you know, he, he knows how to, like, chop off a limb and save somebody and stuff. Perfect. He sounds like our man. Uh, you, you find, uh, Dr. Buzzsaw's office. Is Dr. Buzzsaw uh, Dr. another Dr. troll? Buzzsaw. No. Um, I imagine Dr. Buzzsaw is a beautiful female owl. Uh, you can tell it's Buzzsaw's place because there is a circular saw blade that is just like bolted on the outside like a sign. Like as like decor? You, yeah, like... It, you, yes! Kind like, like, like of like a wreath? No, like... A, like it's a, like... Like a tavern sign? Like in... Oh, yeah. okay. Just... It's like lo looming over the party and Shatterbox is like, I have a good feeling about this. <laughs> you could reach out and spin it if you weren't afraid of hurting your fingers. I'm not going to do it, but I almost did it. And then probably <laughs> I'm sure I'm up to date on my fingers. <laughs> I'm about to say, it's rusty as shit. Uh, the door does not have... Well, have it. We, can, uh, we can get you on while we're here. The door on the... Yeah, I'm resistant to toxins. That means I'm resistant to tinnitus. Or not tinnitus. What is it? Tinnitus. 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 That's the one. Are your ears that... ringing? I, I mean, considering how loud oh, you play music, I hope... <laughs> tinnitus. Oh my god, PK. Listen. It's a perfectly fine volume. What? Uh... What? <laughs> it's fine if you don't need to hear. The door doesn't have a knob on the outside, but it does have one of those uh, slide things for eye holes. Oh, that's fun. All right, Chatterbox is going to go like, bah, 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 and a long pause and wait for a bah, bah. But when it doesn't happen, she's going to like begrudgingly go like, bah, bah. Um, <laughs> yeah. I slide opens and uh, there are two like uh, what's that thing that makes your eyes turn yellow? Uh, ooh, uh, jaundice. jaundice. There are two <laughs> there are jaundice multiple. eyes that look up from yeah. the other side and uh, a, a, a surly voice just asks what do you want? Oh, we were looking to speak to Dr. Buzzsaw himself if he is available, or one of his closest associates if he is not. I know this is last minute. Herself, and I'm right here. Herself? Oh, I'm so sorry. I had to go off of no context other than Dr. Buzzsaw, and that was very sexist of me and very rude. I apologize. My name is Chatterbox. This is my gang. We were wondering if we could step in and talk to you for a quick minute. No. You can ask no. whatever you need to ask from over there. None of you look like you're falling apart, which means you're not my usual clientele. Oh, sure. We'll just ask questions from behind the door. I love that. Very impersonal, and that's how I thrive. She's, like, lying. She's, like, sweating. She's, like, I don't know what to do without her seeing my whole thing. Half of my charm is my, like, ability to swagger into your house drunk. <laughs> P PK like like uh like rubs your shoulders like the yeah, the guy like, in the in the boxing PK. match like yeah, you got this like, kid and you, you got this you got one of the ropes she I it's, I can only communicate with my eyes and that's not I got crazy eyes uh we should I just ask uh oh god the jaundice eyes <laughs> enjoy okay. your jaundice. <laughs> so havoc magically what are we looking for um are... we're looking for anyone who's come in with severe uh burn injuries or maybe look like they've been put through a meat grinder full of teeth gotcha okay we are wondering and i know that there's this whole patient doctor confidentiality thing so i understand what you can and cannot disclose but we are just wondering, and we're asking for the safety of the neighborhood, going around wondering if anybody has been receiving, like, 
severe burns, really bad bite marks, not human bite marks from like a night that went a little too crazy or like a night that went a little too well, if you know what I'm seeing. <laughs> uh, we're looking for some serious biting, any scratching, like somebody who's got fucked up by not quite a human, probably a beast, maybe a fiery beast. You know anything about that? Well, number one, I'm not a doctor. I'm a surgeon. Number two, no. Oh. Okay. I mean, Brief and succinct. There is, I love it. Uh, there is old, uh, old Null, but he was burned to death. And I'm pretty sure... Uh, I'm pretty sure some of the Black Watch got a look at him, and he looked at him funny or something. I don't know. Is, uh... And I don't mean to sound rude or disrespectful or gratuitous. Is his corpse still available for inspection? Yeah, you know what? Fine. There's nothing I can sell to organ leggers anyway. Oh, you're an absolute peach. We love you to death. What's that to have? <laughs> um, there's, uh, there's like a mail return thing on the other side. <laughs> uh, like by where a window has been boarded up. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And um, just this, this, this an entire corpse. charred corpse just flies out of it. <laughs> Cheddarbox like Oof. has to stifle like like a like a dark laugh like a I'm so upset I don't know what else to do laugh like PK does not stifle his very genuine laugh. <laughs> uh, oh. And she comes back over to the eye hole uh, and says, "There, he's your problem now. Have fun, kids." Oh. Can I can I slip her twenty new yen just for being an absolute you doll? You can't. It's on your cred stick. You need to do oh cred, damn cred it! Cred well, I'll just it. blow them lots of kisses through the eye side. Like <laughs> mwah, mwah, mwah. You all. If you're ever in trouble, my name is Chatterbox. You drop it with anyone oh, other than Marco, Miguel, or Silvio. You got that, and I'll get you out of your mess. Oh jeez, I actually ended up finding. Uh... Oh good, burnt corpse prop. I'll take the prop. Oh. Please show me. Please show yeah, me. Yeah, be careful what you put in the Google. Nothing. Uh, oh, delicious. There he is. Yes. Crispy. Oh. Can I start doing a medicine or and or some sort of check since I have perks in medicine? Can I do like a look over? Uh, roll that beautiful logic in medicine and add your I analytical sure mind will. bonus. Yes, I sure will. Is there an assist thing in Shadow Run? Because I also have medicine. No, but you can also roll, and if you roll more hits cool. than Chatterbox, then you know that's 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 yeah. the hits your group gets. Cool. Okay, I've got ten in this, so I feel good. I was say I feel like you'll you'll get it. This is like what she's here for. Is like for talking to people and being like, I know what people are on. I or in this case, I know. Them. Yeah, or I know what killed them. All right, Ooh, three. Four. <gasps> so good. Five. Six. Oh, six successes, baby. That's fair. You got more than my two. Uh, last time I checked, two is less than six. Last time I checked, yeah. But I'm not good at math, so. So, um, you check this corpse over, and um, it, uh, he was an orc. Mm, once upon a time. And um, things are weird. Um, mm. So if this guy was lit on fire, uh, uh, does anybody have any sort of chemical knowledge? Um, I have, I no. have biotech. Knowledge. No, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for like actual chemistry. No, nope. just got nope. like resistance to toxins, and that's it. Aha! Chemistry is a skill. It's not part of any skill group. Bah! So everybody... Make, uh, no, medicine won't help you here. Everybody just make a okay. logic roll if no one has chemistry. Okay. I'll still take it. Alternatively, you could try Nothing. to take this course to a chemist somewhere. Ooh, I got two hits. Two hits. I'll write it down. <laughs> Uh, does anyone Our have... site hit twinsies. Does Yay. anybody have any sort of chemical analyzer thingy? Does, does a no. recorder exist? I only have my analytical mind. 
Well, I have. Well, there's something weird about the burns on his skin. Mm. You're not it, quite mm. sure. You you don't really know. It's not a normal fiery burn. Um, maybe. Mm. Um, like it's entirely possible that somebody fucking burned this guy to death. But um, it, it, it could have been a hellhound that lit him up. It could have been some guys who doused him in gasoline and shoved a tinder stick into his face. Jeez. But at this point, um, he, he was definitely burned to death. Um, mm. That's for certain. And some chunks of him were cut out. Um, and you're pretty sure those chunks were weren't were, weren't cut out with like a knife. Like, also, who would cut out chunks of a burned guy? Uh, gross, suspicious people. True. Mm. Or a very hungry puppy. A very hungry pupper, man. <laughs> or a very hungry pup. <laughs> <laughs> a very murdery doggo. Um, considering I can't find anything that um like analyzes chemicals, uh, I'll just uh, give this one to you. It's clear that there wasn't um any accelerant used. Mm. Like this guy doesn't smell this like gasoline. Right, just some sort of all-natural fire. Right, and if he were on fire, if he had just been lit on fire and he was running around like, oh my god, I'm on fire, uh, there'd it be... It would have gone out. Well, not just that, but like there'd be, like, it might have gone out. Uh, right, if there's no accelerant, there's no way, like, did you know that human beings aren't naturally flammable? Right, it would have gone out if he had tried to put it out unless there were extenuating... Right. circumstances yes the only way gotcha. this guy could have burned to death like this is if there was an accelerant but there isn't right. which means something it's... must have been burning him actively. right it's a suspicious burning yes gotcha well, well that too seems too. like a good lead at least um is that person at the door still available because if so i want to go knock knock and be like i know you might not be able to divulge this information but i feel like we're becoming close pals you and i uh could i possibly trouble you uh where this body was found you, you knock on the door again and it's just she silence. opens up the slide and uh, before she can even say oh you again or before she can even <laughs> slow it you go into your spiel uh, yeah. make a beautiful charisma negotiation roll Perfect. I would love to. Let's see. That's six plus. Oh, yes. Ooh. Don't go flying on me now. My new dice are treating me so well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, that's three hits. Yeah, he was cutting through the sunshine, pa shuns sunshine passage, you know, where the uh, where the Black Watch live. Oh yeah, everybody knows that, of course, naturally. Thank you. You're a doll. So that's why I figure they're the ones who've lit him up. Can, do you need anything else, or can you go uh away? Just which direction would that be in if we were to uh, if we were to happen to look around that area? Which direction would we be headed in? Use your comms or something. Do I look like a GPS? Slow. I just thought I'd ask. I'm sorry to bother you. Thank you. You have a lovely day. God bless you. And she blows another kiss, and then the <laughs> fucking thing probably slams in her face. Oh no! It slammed before you started your yeah. spiel. But I imagine she blows the kiss to an empty, like closed, slotted eye hole door. She was like, "Mwah!" Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I I lean over to uh, Farsight and ask him in in Japanese. Uh, so, um, are are we corpse disposal now? What are we doing with this? I have no idea. I was about to ask. What do you guys do with <laughs> Null? Uh, Chatterbox was just gonna leave him there. Yeah, that's that's what he's yeah. Yeah. What? Uh, like they're I gonna think... treat him that much better inside? I, I take pictures so we can analyze it against something later if we run across it. Smart. Other than that, I, I got nothing. I have an idea. Go for it. Lay I it might, on me, baby. I might be able to get us a little bit of extra help. Um, I can't follow a, a, 
frail of magic, but I might be able to summon a spirit who can. So if it could get the scent from this charred up corpse before we toss it in a dumpster or whatever, then uh, that would be preferable. Can you help me move this over to like a slightly more secluded alleyway? I can do that. The four slightly of you secluded very alleyway. Suspiciously... <laughs> yes. <laughs> we are Scooby doing this. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We accidentally shot the man in the mask before he took his mask off, and we're like, "Oh no!" <laughs> and oh, oops. <laughs> okay. So oh God. Uh, Are you gonna make us roll corpse hiding stats? No. No, uh, not yet. I, you can't hide it yet. I need it. Right. So, Cap, <laughs> what type okay. of spirit are you going to summon? A guidance spirit. Oh shit! It's in the um, the street grimoire. Oh, get it, B. But I sent a, you a, a screenshot a, of say, the page. Send, send me that. That sounds like exactly what you're looking for. New spirit Specifically, type. it has a sensing skill. I guess that's just what I needed. I just needed someone to be. <laughs> um, I needed a summit, a spirit to summit. <laughs> It wasn't my best work, but thank you, PK. <laughs> Mysterious no advice will not be necessary. This thing knows basically what it needs to do. But yeah, sure. Sweet. Uh, roll that beautiful spirit summoning footage. What, at what force will you summon this spirit? I will summon this spirit at force four. Nice. Okay. So choose a spell you wish to cast. Choose a force. Add my magic to the force. One, two, three, five, six. Add my spell hack casting to the pool. I do not have summoning, so I will just add that in, roll it. Don't have any wound modifiers, so I don't need to take that away. That will be one, two, three hits. It's honestly lower than I thought it would be. Um, it's better than a glitch. Yep. It is better than a glitch. Always better than a glitch. So, you can oppose test using summoning plus magic plus force versus the spirit's force. Okay. Yep. So, I will roll four dice. Four. How many successes did you get? I got three. It also got three. Ooh. Do we roll again? Um. You spend reagents to change the limit. If you get no net hits, the spirit doesn't show up. If you get net hits, the spirit arrives nearby in actual space, owing you one service per net hit. Uh, okay. No, uh, the summoning fails. You try to summon a, a a spirit of guidance, and it's just like, uh, you can't tell me what to do. I got an appointment, okay? You, Fuck off, kid. You don't know me. And then you have to resist eight drain. You have to resist eight drain. So I that's believe in you. Two, three, five, six, seven. I'm sorry, twice the number of hits on the spirit's defense. Okay, so never mind. You're resisting six drain. Okay. Well, it's a good time to roll a fuck ton of sixes. Yes, it is. Hell yeah. One, two, three, four, five successes. So you only take one stun damage. Ouch. Ouch. Come. You may try again. Okay. I would like to try again, yes. Force four. Uh, yes. It's like, fine, you don't want to help me? I'll find someone else. I understand you're busy. Have a nice day. One, two, three, four, five, six hits. Okay. Uh, the spirit glitches. <laughs> uh, what do you want, Nestle? Is that what I hear? No. <laughs> I hope so. I hope the fuck not. Havoc, listen, if it was up to me, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> it's what you would hear is, Senpai, what can I do for you? God damn it. This because I meant to write a slice of life, doki doki, academia, <laughs> anime. Whoa! Uh, you summon something that basically looks like this. Huh. Oh! 
that's that, a that's a that would that's a huge bitch. Yeah, that oh, would not I mean, call you some pie. It's not that big. It's just like that the size of a normal head, but it looks like that. That would demand that you call it some pie. Um, that being said, it does have a very uh, confused. Uh, it does have a oh. very confused look on its eyes, but then it realizes what's going on. Hello. Um, thank you for answering my call. I'm in need of some help uh, following the trail of a hellhound that's wreaking havoc across the city. Uh, it furrows its brow. Apparently it doesn't like hellhounds. Well, then I think that you are the absolutely perfect spirit to uh, help me find this thing. Um, all you need to do is is get us there to its lair, and then you're free to go. Uh, it gives a uh, cheerful expression and starts uh, assessing the shit out of it. Holy fuck. Yeah. I'm putting so many points into summoning after this. Yeah. <laughs> PK that... gives you an enormous high five. Oh, only, yeah. only uh, Havoc can see it. Like, as far as the rest of you are concerned, uh, the universe has made... Yeah, we just chilling. Like, the universe has... Like, there is a strange smell in the air. Is that me? Chatterbox is, like, sniffing under her jacket, like... But, no, uh, from... I mean, there's a lot I am. There, but it's not me. It's not me this time. PK, check. <laughs> nope. Uh, just regular stank? Okay, that's what I thought. There's a different stank in the air, right? <laughs> From Havoc's look of pure <laughs> awe, um, you can probably guess that this spell was a great success. Oh, PK's doing, or uh, Havoc's doing something. Havoc's wreaking some havoc over there, if you know what I'm saying. There we um, go. Wrenches his, his gaze back into the physical plane. Um, uh, yeah, uh, got some help, and um, they're going to lead us to the Hellhound. Ooh, Damn, good job, right. Havoc! Uh, if we want to... Uh, we'll sorry, follow your mold. lead. It sounds like you're following them, and it sounds like we'll follow you. Uh, reach down to just sort of pat the charred corpse on, on the shoulder and say, uh, sorry, we'll avenge you, I guess. Yeah. Chatterbox puts her hands down. She's like, I didn't know you. But I bet you were great. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. Lucy. <laughs> you can't be <hit> time, man. <laughs> oh I shit, I gotta you, um But I bet you were great. I totally forgot to resist drain on that. Oh yes. Uh, oh, resist I, uh, that drain. You don't have to, it glitched. Oh hey. you know? Uh, these things happen. Entry. Uh <laughs> But so it, it, the, the leaves and branches around it curl into a question mark and then it just sort of starts floating away. Okay, I'm going to try to keep pace with it. The rest of you give pace after Havoc. Yeah, who is like we all jog after stopping. Havoc. Like, like, everyone who's like, there are some, you know, kids hanging out on the street and some people doing their thing and some people looking out their windows and anyone who drives by just sees the four of you running around like fucking maniacs. Yeah, it's like make way for ducklings, but with full grown adults who are of various and the races. duck is on the astral plane. Yep. Exactly. We're just like, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I imagine it's kind of leading us in, in circles a little bit and we're just following it and breaking the flow of traffic uh, eventually it leads you here Ooh. Ooh. and Ooh. it uh, stares alleyway mm. alright guys I think I think this might be it Ooh, we about to fight some doggos yeah, Chatterbox um, is like flexing her hands and popping her knuckles, like ready, getting ready to go. Just, just get ready. These things breathe fire. They're smart. It'll probably try to lead us into a trap. Don't underestimate it, okay? My right. guess is if we see it, maybe we fan out because it's probably got all kinds of breathy weapons. I don't know how dogs work, but maybe. I think that's how fire breathing dogs work. This is yeah, uh, my so, first time seeing so one as well. So when we see one, we'll like fan out and keep some distance. And... 
No, group okay, up. Like, Please group up. No, you can't trick us no. like that. <laughs> wait, wait. Wait, wait. Maybe what if he... we. Wait. Maybe Hold on. He's... If he. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, if he's but, telling like, us if... to group up, we should definitely be grouping up. Let me tell you. <laughs> we'll have a good time doing that. <laughs> I should mention, uh, the, the spirit has led you someplace, like, it, every street it leads you down is more derelict than the next. You're not in the barrens, but, you know, there are still shitty pockets of downtown. It's like the shittiest part of downtown, or the shittier parts of downtown. Exactly. It's a part of downtown that other downtowners don't acknowledge. Are we getting close to Redmond? As Chatterbox, she identifies with that. She was like, yo, people don't talk about Poil Up. I get it. Um, it's like the Poil Up of downtown. And yes, you guys are actually headed towards Redmond, but like being on this side of the checkpoint is infinitely better than being on that side of the checkpoint. Heck yeah. It's like this might be a shithole, but at least it's not Redmond. Seriously. Listen, I got Winnie on my side, so if we need checkpoints, I'm good. Yeah, but... um, let me see if I can find uh, security ratings. Oh god, there's so many times security shows up in this game. Give us the security ratings, daddy. Here we go. Oh. So, like, we've gone from... <laughs> we've gone from d triple A security levels to C ranking security levels. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that dropped off fast. Yep. That's easy breezy. Uh, so, like, triple A is downtown. Double A is, like, a luxury residential area. A ranking is mid to high level residential, or, like, a corporation. Like, a simple corporation b ranking is a mid-level residential and industrial district and c is low-end residential and storage this definitely uh is one of those and z is redmond barons or the chicago containment zone don't worry about it anyway don't worry about i'm it. worried about uh, it the spirit Oops. has gestured towards this building okay um, then and there is a uh, door in front of you. It uh, it obvious. It seems obviously locked. That's interesting. I don't know hellhounds Ooh. to uh, lock doors behind them. It might have gone in through another way. That does present an issue. Yes. Would my palming skills help at all at that, or is that just for swiping things? That's just for swiping things. Okay, uh, I, I don't know. Lock picking is its own specific skill. Uh, I don't think I picked anything up in that. Sorry, folks. But if I recall, doesn't one of you have an auto picker? I think PK I does. sure do. PK coming up with the auto picker. Uh, what rating is your auto picker? My auto picker is rating four. Nice. That's pretty good. Nice. Yeah. Uh, it's actually some good shit. Let me look up what auto pickers do. Page four hundred and forty-seven. <gasps> hey, auto pickers baby, are small. Um, they're like, it's like I, I imagine it is like the size of a key. Uh, oh no, it's much larger than that. It's like the size of a street line special. Oh okay. So it's like the size of a very small gun, like Austin Powers gun. You know that small. But instead, the bullet it shoots is lock. It's a key. Yeah. <laughs> Let's figure out how auto pickers work, kids. Yay. <laughs> Uh, the auto picker's rating is added to your limit when picking a mechanical lock. Um, uh, let's see, add the auto picker's rating as a nice pull modifier to your chest when picking a mechanical lock. Uh, the lock. This lock pick gun is a quick and effective way of bypassing mechanical locks. It's um, a lock pick gun. Okay, so make an agility and lock picking roll. Okay. Just agility. <laughs> so I have the auto picker because you can try hooking up the auto picker to the matrix, or more accurately, you can have. Um, uh, I would say have Farsight hook it up to the matrix. Yes, you can have Farsight hook up your auto picker to the matrix. Perfect. What I do? Uh, make a logic and hardware roll. Will do. Let's see. Hardware is free. Bringing that whole thing up to a nine. 
And we have uh, five hits. Yep. Nice. You jam that yeah. thing up. So, PK, add four dice to your roll. Yeah. Nice, 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 nice. Hell yeah. Aww. Aww. I got one success. Spend edge. Do it, you coward. <laughs> I spend edge. All right. So uh, take all of your failed dice and uh, roll them again. You get to okay. keep your hits, but you get to re-roll some stuff. Roll better. I got one more success. <laughs> one more is all you needed. Wow! Yeah! <laughs> that being said, I'm looking for something specific. It's from a long time ago. Let's see if I can find it. I believe in you. Oh, oh, here it is! <laughs> <laughs> So you open up the door and there are four guys inside just hanging out. There's a TV going on in the background. Um, they've all, they're all obviously armed um, and they see you come through the door mm. and then this starts. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> what am I <laughs> It's back. Yes. Like, oh, thank you so much. Yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> like, you, you, you open up the door, and these four guys are like t one orc, cheddar and boss, elf and cheddar two boss. Humans. In the dead of the silence, where they're all looking at each other and ourselves, cheddar boss just raises one hand and goes, Hi! <laughs> <laughs> uh, make a beautiful uh, charisma oh my God. etiquette roll and add your. Can I really? Yes, yes. and add your uh, good impressions bonus. Yes, I am. That's fucking funny. You're gonna want a lot of successes on this. Yeah. Edge is suggested. Oh yeah. Well, I've got ten before I even give the good one. Yeah, but if you spend edge now, you get rule of six. Four. What's rule of six? You get to re-roll sixes. Why would I want to re-roll sixes? No, no, you, you keep the six, and then you roll oh. another die. And you also get and... to add your edge pool. Oh. Hang on. Let me look at how much edge I have. And what does it mean if when I burn edge? What does that mean? Okay, so there's spending and there's burning. Spending mm -hmm. means you get all the bonuses I, 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 I brought up, and you get edge back at the end of every day. If mm -hmm. you get a good night's rest. Yeah. If you burn an edge, you can do some wacky shit, and then you erase it from your sheet forever. I'll just spend edge. Yeah. 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 So if I spend edge, I get to re-roll the sixes, but save them as sixes? Yes. Well, you'll cool. also be able to add your edge pool to the roll. Oh, cool. So what's Let your me maximum find my edge. edge? Let me see. I th think it's four. So you'll add four extra Let dice. me check. Let me double check. I'm having a hard time spotting it on my sheet. Because I'm dumb! You're not dumb. Oh, yeah. I have four edge points. I will spend one. Sounds good. Does that mean I get to re-roll one of my sixes? Uh, so you get to add four dice, and you get to re-roll as many sixes as oh. you roll. And if you, oh. and if you roll another six, you roll again. You, so you I add... So I add four dice to my pre-existing 12 dice, and then I get to re-roll any of my sixes? Yes. Yes. Your sixes, <laughs> sixes quote-unquote, explode. I mean, ha-ha! Normal laugh. Totally normal reaction. <laughs> I mean, it's cool. <laughs> right? Uh, you can spend edge to get a second chance, seize the initiative, blitz... Uh, 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 have a close call or initiate a dead man's trigger. I'm just gonna walk in and be like, "Hi, we're taking over your shift. You didn't know the boss is becoming way better about those labor laws." <laughs> and and PK uh, hops up behind her with a shotgun. I a vast. I a vast. All right. Um, and... Flat terrain. Ooh, I missed one. Ooh, good so far, though. <gasps> yeah! And uh, right. Burning an Edge gives you two things. Uh, burning an Edge gives you the smackdown. 
which gives mm. you four net hits. Not four hits, four net hits. So if it's a contested roll, you get four more than they got. Um, Ooh, well, I got six hits after a re-roll that's pretty good. of one six. So I got like a bunch of fives and one six. So I got six hits overall. Um, and you can also burn an edge to invoke the hand of God. Uh, if you but, invoke the hand of God, you don't die. Well, I hope I'm not going to die right now. That being said, you can only <laughs> burn edge that you have. Yeah. So if you don't have any edge, you can't burn any edge. Right. I burned one edge, and after a rest, I get that edge back. No, no, no. So, like, let's say you, you have four edge, and you spent four edge. Yeah. And something is about to kill you. And you're like, oh, fuck, I don't want to die. Can I burn yeah. an edge? I'll be like, no, you spent it all. Right. So you can't but burn I... an edge you don't have to spend. But I burned one edge. You spent one edge. I spent one edge. What's the difference between spending and burning? I'm spending sorry. Spending means it comes back. Burning means you erase it from your sheet forever. Oh, I don't want to do that. Yeah, no, no, you don't want to burn it. You just spent it. Oh, okay. I'm being dumb. Anyways, I hit, I got six successes. Nice work. Like you <laughs> and say, hey and like. Yeah, I'm like, hello. And one of them just says, hey. And the rest hey. of them say, hey. 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 My boys, hey. listen, you don't know me, but obviously you know that I'm one of the good guys. We're here to cover your shift. The boss man is shifting things over. He's reconsidering the whole manual labor thing, and he's cutting shifts down so that you guys can go spend time with you and yours. Um, so we're going to start spending. <laughs> we're going to take over. We're going to come in at the very least. You guys can stay if you want, but we're going to we're going to take over the responsibilities for sure. They all just start laughing. Just like, "Oh my god." And they're like, "Oh hey. shit." <laughs> you know me, it's me. Hey. Nah, man, with the black watch, we live here. <laughs> no, I know. No, I know, but I'm just saying if you guys wanted to, you know, like fuck off a little like we got you covered. No, 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 no. I mean, like, we live here. And, like, he points to a series of bunk beds, and you realize like, <laughs> this is just, like, where these guys live. And they're like, that's a good bit. That's a good bit. <laughs> I know, I know. That's the joke. That's the joke. Obviously. <laughs> Cheddarbuck just, like, God, silently sweeps her brow while nobody's like, I know that, obviously. <laughs> Can I try to look around um, Chatterbox standing in the doorway to see if they have like a oh yeah i'm coming a in dog You're... bowl or oh, yeah. something absolutely yeah we're coming into the room cheddarbox doesn't stand in the doorway once she gets an a she's like okay i have permission to move into this space oh yeah these guys are all heavily armed but you've just disarmed them completely yeah i just have walked in and i'm like i'm one of you you know me you don't know me but you know me <laughs> um but uh, yeah. everybody who's interested, make an intuition yes, and please. perception roll. Would love to. Intuition and what? Uh, intuition and perception. <laughs> Three ones and two hits. Ugh. Two hits. Uh, one hit. Wait. Four hits. Ooh. I got one hit. Oh no, Chatterbox, you're way too busy talking to these guys. Oh yeah, that's fine. Uh, I'll, I'm keeping them busy so everybody else can notice. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Farsight, uh, yep. instead of looking for anything interesting, you see what these While guys... While everyone is noticing, I'm going to go to the bathroom. With. Uh, yeah. Yep. Uh, they are armed with... Um, small, easily concealable weapons. Um, nice. Where... Uh, there we go, machine pistols. Uh, th these guys are armed with Seska Black Scorpions. Ooh, interesting. Uh, which are some of the cheapest, shittiest guns you can buy. A classic machine pistol provides concealable burst fire capability. It comes equipped with an integral folding stock. Uh, the stocks have been cut off to make them look cooler. Okay, so we're dealing with uh, low end budget uh, mercenaries. Yeah, these guys are these guys are low end gangers. Um, nice. So like uh, a machine pistol look like this. Uh, 
and it's just a pistol that fucking pisses bullets. Oh. Oh. Uh, Actually, it looks kind of cool. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, it's an effective weapon. It's dangerous. It's uh, it's got um, bu- 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 it's got thirty five shots in the uh, it's got thirty five shots in the bu- bu- magazine, and it uh, you know, it's got burst fire. Oh, it has negative recoil com- uh, compensation. Well then. Interesting. Oh no, I'm sorry. The stock gives it one, but they've removed the stocks. Done. Uh, basically, if these guys Done. shoot too many bullets too quickly, the the gun will start spraying out of their hands. But let's not worry about that. <laughs> oh, I see a picture of a gun. That's a lot. Yeah, that's of bullets. what they're armed with. Oh, are they pointing it at us yet? No, no they're oh, it's very cool. casual. Cool. Yeah, cool. And then we're not worried about them. it. There is a Defiance T two fifty, like located on like a mantelpiece. Uh, the Defiance 250 is yeah. what... Uh, like, please explain. Isn't that what Painkiller? Isn't that what you have? It sure Ooh. is. Yeah. Um, A little uh, sexy piece of equipment there. Uh, this thing ha- uh, has uh, has the barrel sawn off. Uh, <laughs> A common sight on the mean streets when things escalate beyond pistols and knives. This semi-automatic shotgun is available in either a normal length or short barreled version. It is gas-operated, but also features a secondary pump action for situations where preventing jams is more important than firing quickly. The short-barreled version has the concealability of plus four and the uh, range of a heavy pistol. The big thing is this thing does ten physical damage if you get hit with it. Oh, shit! Ooh. Yeah, so that's why I've got mine. Yeah. <laughs> let's, uh, let's keep schmoozing the bozo. Yeah, and, like, the four guys with Seska Black Scorpions, like, they have them, like, in belts, or, like, one, like one of them is cleaning his gun, and, like, he, like, when you open the door, he shoved the magazine in, uh, it's still missing right, a couple pieces. Right, he was pieces, ready to but, go. Right, it'll, it's still missing a couple pieces, but it'll probably fire, but you've diffused the situation pretty well. That being yeah, said. Yeah, I just came in and was like, hey, hey. what's up? What's up? <laughs> And it's just super. Who knew that saying "What up" is super effective against gangers? It just Chatterbox did. Time. Chatterbox did. <laughs> she was the one person that she was like, "Hang on, watch this." What's up? <laughs> Hold my beer. What's up? So, uh, what's that being up? Said, uh, painkiller. You don't notice much in the room. Um, you can't help <laughs> notice that what? they're watching. Um, Porn. Uh, are they're they watching, watching Razor Girl Wedding? No, they're watching uh, Fresh My Creature Opera. Show. Ooh. It's not... Fresh Culture Opera? Fresh Creature Opera. Oh, that's that's not as good, but it's better somehow. Uh, Fresh Creep- Creature Opera is a, uh, a reality show singing competition uh, exclusively uh, with Sasquatches and Yetis as contestants. Yeah! That's outstanding. Um, because Sasquatches and Yetis are, they have the intellect of a normal human, uh, but the issue is they don't have the ability to vocalize. They can only mimic sounds. Oh. Chatterbox is, like, moving towards the couch being like, oh my god, have you seen a Sasquatch do the rendition of, like, Like a Diamond by Rihanna? It's so fucking good! (laughs) That's pretty vintage. That being said, right? Um, uh, Rihanna's so outdated, but we're here for her. Oh, we're here for her. Uh, we're here for her. Uh, that being said, uh, Havoc, you yeah. recognize that there is no evidence of a dog here. Oh, shit. And no evidence of any, like, fire or anything. It's pretty clear that, it's like, this is the gang that uh, Buzzsaw mentioned, and it's pretty evident that they didn't kill Null, in case it wasn't uh. police already. Like, these okay. guys don't even, like, these guys are stealing their electricity, and they don't have mm-hmm. access to running water. Okay. Um, they have, like, a, they have a Nutrisoy stock. It is very empty. Um, and uh, you see a, a an overflowing pile of, oh, my bad, this is what these guys are packing. Because this just looks too fucking good and stupid. <laughs> oh my god. Yes. That's a nice little gun there. Uh, but you know what? They yeah, cut off the barrel. They got rid of that. Got to be concealable. <laughs> um, 
So yeah, this thing is a giant. That would that would provide additional recoil compensation, and they just got fucking rid of that. It looks it looks cool, but eh, it makes it harder to hide. Uh, anyway, point being, uh, these guys are not the hellhound that you're looking for. Although it does it it does. Uh, everybody, give me a straight lo uh, You know what, Havoc? Give me a straight logic roll. Okay. No success. Was it a single <laughs> die? Yes. Then I got a three. Uh, nope. Oh, hey. Uh, hiding a metahuman body gives you a plus ten modifier to your stealth. As in, you need ten additional successes. Um, uh -huh. anyway. Holy shit. It's hard to hide a body. <laughs> like, in a coat or something. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, anyway. Uh, you try to rub your brain cells together, but they ain't sparking, kid. That's fair. Uh, that being said, uh, like, you guys can chill out in the oh. Black Watch's place for a little while. But I was gonna say, can Cheddarbox ask the boys if they've seen it? She's like, so, uh, listen. This might sound crazy, but bear with me. I've been hearing weird gossip downtown about, like, a weird dog. Like, a crazy, ugly dog. And have you guys heard anything about, like, any, like, real violent dogs? Or, like, dogs on fire? Or, like, dogs right. setting people on fire? <laughs> uh, the, the elf preempts, like, your question and just says, Nope, uh, we killed no. Yep, burn them up. Oh, Judge right. intentions. Roll yeah, can judge I intentions, judge right? the Reason, fuck out you. of those intentions? Yeah, judge the fuck out of those intentions. Which I have just a natural ten in. Which I'm so glad I did that. <laughs> One, two, three, four, four ten. hits. I'm I'm so glad I spent like all of my karma on this. I gave myself good stats and everything else, and this is the one thing that I was like, I got this. Although, if I say that and fuck this up now, I'll cry. Oh, so good. One, two, three, four. Four successes. Uh, Painkiller, the elf doth protest too much. That is the mm. question that you asked him. <laughs> right? It's that was just sort of his pre-packaged answer. Uh, Havoc and Chatterbox, you guys figure out pretty quickly, they didn't kill Null. Uh, mm. they just want to say that they did because it makes them sound more impressive. Oh, gotcha. Uh, but it is evident that, like, it is evident that, like, they had cause to kill him. Right. Um, so it's not like, you wouldn't brag about killing someone out of the blue. Like, that's a real dick move. Yeah. Uh, but so, like, they probably had cause to kill Null, and then he ended up getting burned alive around here, and they said, yeah, it was us. We did it. Mm. And like, the, hmm. like the way he said that, that's been like their, it's been his canned answer forever. Yeah, just like yeah, we totally took care of Null. Don't even ask questions. Don't worry about it. Yes. Oh man, what did yeah. what did Null do this time? Uh, what was the last straw? Uh, and the orc says, "You owed us some money," and a human pipes in and says, "Yeah, a shit ton. You owed us three thousand new yen." And we said, "It's your." Uh, and then the elf continues, and we said, "It's your money or your life, kid." And he was like, take my life. Wow. So we doused him in gasoline that's, and lit him on fire. That sounds sounds bad, about right. That's some badass shit, for sure. For this sure. Is one of the most poorly constructed cover stories you've heard in your Oh, yeah. Life. We're like, we're, <laughs> like, we're <laughs> politely indulging in it. We're like, we're, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Feeling we give each out. other a look. Yeah, Havoc of, and. We and caught Havoc their and, bullshit. Yeah, Chatterbox and Havoc are like, uh I know. Chatterbox specifically is like, listen, I know bullshit when I see it because I fucking spew bullshit all day. Don't you give me that. <laughs> oh. She's like, oh man, you guys nerfed one of your own guys? That must have been fucking epic. What, how did it go down? How'd you do it? You know, where, where did it go down? Tell me everything. You guys sound like real fucking badasses. Uh, they, they, I got a hit. They, oh, man. Uh, let, let me get the gift. <laughs> <laughs> Please and thank you. 
They start giving each other one of these. Yeah, just more. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, well, Noel wasn't part of the gang. He was just uh, some Right, right. Guy. A, nor a normal civilian. He's just a guy I'm... that, you know, came to us, you know, for help. And so we helped right, him Right, harmless out. civilian. And Go he on. He didn't pay up when, when uh -huh. we asked him very politely. And he just kept borrowing more and more. And we... Succumb okay. to the sunk cost fallacy, so we yeah. kept loaning him right. more new yen, and then you know right. we had to make we had to make a sign to make sure that people knew they couldn't do this anymore. And yep. I mean, we'll show you, we'll, we'll, yeah. we'll show you where it happened. Show me where it happened. I'm yeah. so in, like I'm intrigued. Not I'm so intrigued. You guys sound like fucking badasses, and I want to see where badass shit went down. Like they, they start looking at each other, <laughs> and they all pocket their Seska's, and they're like, "Yeah, we'll show you." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cheddar Boss is like, "Bro, I gotta see it." You guys are so dope. She's just like stroking their fake panicked egos and like, "Ah, uh, yeah." Um, so they, 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 you know, shoo you guys out of the hideout and they all come yeah. out and close the door behind them. Uh, and uh -oh. they wander around the building. Um, and, uh, like, oh, you know what? Havoc, uh, you oh, realize yeah. there used to be a door that goes from their room to, uh, the rest of the building, but it's been, hmm. uh, it's been, uh, walled over. Interesting. Um, uh, brick and plascrete. Mm. Uh, I'll file that away. A solid construction. Uh, but they, they, they lead you guys around to the, uh, the other side of the building. And uh, they point to a black patch on the... Uh, uh, excuse me. On the... Uh, on the um, me again. Uh, a black patch on the, on the pavement. And they're like, yep, this is where, this is where we, uh, like, one of them says, this is where we found him. And then, like, takes an elbow to the, <laughs> to the ribs. And says, yeah, this is where we torched him. Fucking uh, lit him up good. And then, uh, we took his body to old Granny Buzzsaw to try to make some, try to make something off of his fucking corpse. And, oh, uh, smart. She, she paid us 300 for the body. And, uh, yeah, maybe there's something she can salvage out of that. I don't give a fuck. They, yeah, they I mean, give hey. lots of fucks. Listen, he gave, he owed you money, and then you had to make a statement, and then you turned to profit off as his corpse. That's just smart business. That's just smart finance. But. Excuse me, streetcar. But yeah, then, excuse You are not I. lying. That was literally one hour. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to be right. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, Chatterbox. Chatterbox is like, well, yeah, he owed you money. You guys had to make a statement. You know, of course, this is where you off to, Mila. <laughs> um, uh, you succeeded into your, the fake lie. You, you, you all succeeded on your judge intentions rule. Uh, Fuck you. Like, they're all just lying. Well, not only are teeth. they lying, but they're actually pretty upset that Null got killed. Oh, like not upset. Like, oh, we're sad. They're upset because he owed them 3000 new yen and they only got 300 for his corpse. Oh, yeah. They didn't really turn a profit on that. Oh, they that's a that's a twenty seven hundred the opposite new yen loss. That's oh, jeez. No, was a big investment for them. And God damn, Oops. was it a bad one? Oops. Good thing. We'll find the dog that cheated them and we'll take care of it. Um, well, I mean, funny you should mention that. Hmm. Because a dog appears and attacks us all. I mean, it. <laughs> oh, wow, that's an unhappy puppy. Oh my god, Chatterbox should be scared, but she's like, <gasps> Puppy! <laughs> yeah, she's a dumbass who's like, <gasps> Puppy! Oh my god, he sounds like he wants a snack, you guys. Who's got dog treats? Nobody? Oh. No, I forgot the milk oh. bones at home. Are you fucking kidding me? I didn't bring any either! Oh no! Wait, wait. Things get worse. <laughs> it gets worse than that? Because oh, no. I was laughing through it, but it oh. was... Ooh! Baby right, right, right. boy! That, that's... There's, there's one puppy... <laughs> Oh no, there's Puppy. two. Oh, I like them. Oh. At which I'm point, gonna feel sad. At which when point, hurt one of the them. gangers pipes up and just says, "There's two! Oh, you fucking 
fucking liars. I knew you were fucking. Guys, there wasn't supposed to be two of them. Everybody roll the initiative. Well, there's two now. Can Chatterbacks turn to the boys and be like, listen, if you kick their asses with us, I won't tell anybody you didn't kick ass before. Ooh, Ooh can I try that? Eric, can I try Eric, a persuasion? Ed, roll that beautiful charisma and persuasion footage. If Hell you're willing yeah. to sacrifice your first round in combat. I? Do what it. do you guys think? I'm going to do it. Do it. Okay. It was charisma plus persuasion? Yes. Oh, I have so much in that. About to say, is persuasion a skill? Did I just make that up? Or whatever, whatever you said. Next what did you year. say? Yeah, I think persuasion is a skill. Uh, um, I've got leadership. I'm about to say, roll leadership. Sweet, awesome. That gives me a, an extra three to my six, so that's pretty nice. Woo! Oh yeah, I should roll initiative for these things. Ooh yeah. Two. Three, four, four successes, no ones. All right, niches. God, I love these new dice. Oh, just kidding. Four successes, one one, but still four successes. Yeah, I'll burn. I'll burn my first one for that. Nope. I got a nine. That seems worth it to be like y'all don't want to seem like pussies. Fucking help fight these boys. You got a nine, Farsight? Yeah. Yeah, Farsight. Uh, six, seven, Am I rolling for initiative after that? Um, yes. Okay. 15. Like, you, 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 you still yeah, roll initiative, I burn, but you won't. I burned the first turn, but just so we know where I stand in initiative. Oh, yes, yes, yes. That I makes rolled sense. the best I possibly could. One, two, nice work. Three, four, six. It's okay, Farsight. You have time. I also rolled the best I possibly could. Nice. I dropped some dice as I was rolling. Hello. So initiative is just hits again, or? Uh, no, you roll the dice, and then you add that to your initiative. You add those numbers together, and you add them onto your initiative score. Okay. All of them? Yes. So you, okay. So wait, you wait, wait, wait. Uh, you roll one die. Oh, right. I have I have one d six plus seven. Yes. So, so you I roll, roll one d six and then adds. Yes. Gotcha. Okay. Sorry, I'm being dumb. No, you're fine. To be fair, I'm in character and I'm method acting. So I'm drunk. I was just making sure because they're sick of combat. <laughs> Ooh, I got a six plus a seven. So I will. Matchy, matchy. Yeah, twinsies. About to say, these yeah, guys PK and I are twins. These guys aren't mouth breathers, but they are street scum. We are so in sync. But I speak that street speak, yo. So I'm like, y'all, fucking fight with me and I won't tell everybody you're fucking pussy. I mean, that's pretty big motivation. Uh, right? Havoc, what's your agility score? My agility score is three. Ooh. Hellhound one goes before you. I'm gonna take one quick tinkle before we start fighting doggos. That's a good idea. BRB. Uh, Painkiller, what's your agility? My agility is four. I don't think you have as much agility as a doggo. Oh, huh, you have the same. Do we want to... Uh, how do we... I'm saying the Hellhound goes because it's a dog. That's fair. It's got more legs than you. Your argument it's got more dog. legs, it's got instincts, and... Yeah, yeah, but my legs are better. I have anxiety, so I can go first. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go in my spells... How much health do these guys have? Pro 
Probably more than we'd like. No, not the Hellhounds. Uh, oh. You're, you're <laughs> Probably less support. than we'd like. Yep. Uh, okay, it's a manipulation. Cool. Okay. So, Katie returns, combat begins. Let me look up elemental attack. Okay. Seems fine. Uh, that's this exotic ranged weapon. Okay. Uh, Havoc, it becomes clear to you why your guidance spirit led you to this building. It probably just made a mistake. It, that's fine. It did seem clumsy. As far as well, you know, it, it did its job. I still gave it a great spirit Yelp review because it did <laughs> what I asked it to do, which was guide me to the right location. I didn't say bring me to the right location. I should be learn to be more specific in the future. Whatever you say, Mac. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hellhounds have an edge score. Noted. Because they're, they're good boys. Oh, God, this could go very poorly. I imagine they have really good initiatives. Oh, they do. That's their thing. Just, uh, uh, right, it, they can only use their fire breath once per turn. Uh, like, once per round. Okay. <laughs> so. I'm just going to... Okay. But Katie's taking a tinkle. And I'm reading through my spells. Getting them up. So everybody think about what you want to do, even though these uh, puppers are going to ruin your day no matter what. <laughs> yep. Da -da 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 -da. But right, based on the Black Watch's response, they were aware that there were hellhounds in the building. Or at least there was something living in there. Gotcha. Because, if you'll recall, he said, There are two? Alright, I have my panic button response. I have... CB is back. Basic. Welcome back. Gracias. De nada. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, the uh, demon moveth through me. <laughs> the uh, hellhound number one uh, uh -oh. breathes fire ah! all over one of the Night's Watch. Ah! Um, See how much it rolls. Oh, how m did I get all of them to join us? Oh into yeah, the like they yeah. All, like, they all draw their Sesco's. I was like, like don't be pussies, fucking fight this thing, and I'll tell everybody you're. Um, Fuck yeah! But how much did they roll? Four and four. Oh, so glad I recruited these bitches. Each three fifteen. It's just other bitches to soak up damage for us. The meat shield. Just a meat shield. Wow, that is a lot. So, um, that's two net hits plus eight. So it rolls a number that it wishes was higher to soak. <laughs> Nine. Oh lord. Okay. Um, and this hellhound 
burns Panther to death. Jesus Christ! Like, Holy. it just engulfs Panther in flames. You don't even know that that was his name. Fucking... Like, ah, one Panther! Of the, one of the guys, like, they're, they're drawing out their machine pistols, and this thing just... Yeah. And he's like, oh, God, why? Oh, no. Holy Ooh. fuck! Oh, I can't believe that just fucking happened! <laughs> that could have been one of us! Thank God we found these meat shields! <laughs> Yikes. Um, now, was that a spell cast? No. It's no? Just, fire just an breath. innate. Okay. Just an innate ability. Yuck. Yep. I can't do anything to defend against that. Oh, nope. Other than beat the shit out of them. You can get behind me. Yeah, you can shoot them with a gun. Uh, speaking, I have a gun. Speaking of getting of behind somebody. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we oh, all hide never behind. Mind. It's time for another Black Watchman to die. So my question is, there are two different portrayals of two different hellhounds. Do they look different or like an amalgamation of both images you sent us? They look like two different breeds. Uh, Gotcha. Interesting. Uh, Just for funsies, I thought I'd ask. A thing, like in the same way that dogs have different breeds, hellhounds have different breeds. One is a little lighter fur coat. Can you get like a chihuahua sized hellhound? Uh, Yes, please. That's more (laughs) our thing. Yes! How much inbreeding you want to happen? All of it. uh, Chatterbox grits her teeth and she's like, I'm not gonna do it, but I'm not saying I wouldn't want to do it. Oh, God. Uh, All right, we have a second dead Night's, uh, Night's Watchman. Oh, God! <laughs> These things <laughs> just <laughs> fucking breathe the fire. Okay, like, don't be scared. The Night's Watchmen have worse armor than you do. Like, that's what's killing them. I'm a little them. scared, though. Oh. I'm a little scared, though. Like, two of them just get fucking burned alive. And they're like, oh, as the ta- As the talker of the group, I'm a little scared. Though. And, like, like their guns fire, and then, uh, like, all of the bullets just start... It, it like firing out of the magazine as the temperature gets too high. Shatterbox oh, no. is just like slowly scrooching down behind painkiller. Like, don't. <laughs> That's don't okay. Be... He's big enough to meet shield all of you. Yeah, please shield me and I'll shoot behind you. Speaking of painkiller, yeah. one of the hellhounds goes to attack you. All right, it can do. It can try. Uh, it's gonna try. It's already used its fire breath, so it can't do that again. Yay! Praise meat shields. Uh, Yay, meat shield! Interesting. So the fire breath is the really dangerous thing. Okay. Um, so, soak eight physical. Okay, so this is, I uh, add my, my armor and my body and I roll that number. Yes. Uh, so okay. track one for the Hellhound's armor piercing. Okay. Uh... Five, six. Hold on. I have to put all these tiny dice into my giant lesbian hands. Yes, lesbian hands. The luckiest type of hands. <sighs> it's true. There we go. Okay. Right? Man, that was not... That's a lot of twos. <laughs> that's okay. Twos are better than ones. I got two successes. And just and six, seven twos. That's a that's statistically improbable. So, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, do you have your defiance out, or do you have a different weapon? I have the defiance out. Sweet. So you take out your defiance from under your coat, and this thing starts biting at your robo legs, and you're like, no, 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 teeth. I need that. those. And you, you know, you swipe down with your arm to bat it away, and it bites onto your arm and like drags you down, and is just tearing the shit out of your arm, and you take six physical damage. Nice. You... Oh damn. Oh fuck. Uh, there's not a lot of tissue damage. You're just bleeding really bad. Uh, it. Uh, oh man, it slit your wrists. Oh, ah! you son of a bitch. Uh, so. <laughs> does, that... does it does it cauterize it because its teeth are hot? No. Damn. Mm. Um. Actually, it's that. immune to fire. By some peculiar magical property, fire just slides off it like water off a duck's ass. It's like a fire genasi. It's like I can summer fire, but if you try to fireball me, like I'll be like. <laughs> exactly. I eat that shit for breakfast. That's yeah, it's like without any milk. 
How are you going to burn me when I'm made of fire? How are you going to do that? You can't. Wish I could. Wish Havoc. I could, but you can't. Havoc? Oh, oh, yes. Oh, Hello. Okay, I, I thought that you were making a, a different comment. Um, so let me get an idea of, of this battlefield here. We're in like an alleyway? You're in an alleyway. Uh, the Night's Watchmen are sort of, they're all grouped up in one area because they're pointing out what was going on and, you know, giving each other the gifts there. Um, and you guys are in a sort of semicircle around the uh, chunk of pavement that they're pointing to. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, so there's going to be South Alley, which is where you came from, and then there's North Alley, which would be the other way. Um, Painkiller is the closest to South Alley, um, and then you guys can arrange yourself in any way that you want around the Crescent. Woo. Okay. Sorry, this just really helped. And, the, and then the Hellhounds are coming from the South Alley or the North Alley? Uh, the Hellhounds are coming from what would be the East Side, which is okay. like a, a like a wall. Gotcha. I can make it. So they just appeared. If you want it. I yes, please. Yeah. <laughs> please and thank you. Thank you, MS Paint. Yay, um, MS Paint. Just so because okay. I have area of effect things, and uh, I need an idea of where people are. Get that area of effect, yo. Because you said that they are resistant to, uh, or immune to fire, yes? Yes. Cool. Either this is going to be a really good idea, or a really bad idea. I believe in you either way. Thanks, Boo. Got you, Boo. Because this is going to hurt. <laughs> oh god, my poor C drive. What the hell is on my C drive? Oh, porn? I think I fucked up. I think I made a mistake porn? and put something on my C drive that wasn't supposed to. Was it porn? No. No. But it was porn? No, my porn goes no. to the special drive. Oh, save your porn just like a dang your, fool. Uh, probably just put a video recording in the wrong folder. <laughs> oh, no, that's what it is. It's all my video recordings. Gotcha. Well, that explains it. That'll do it. Because they're in a file. Um, my smarty well. pants. Thank you, Cap. You're welcome. Behold the map. Oh, perfect. Yes. Awesome. Nice. Excellent. Guys, Idiots. You guys. You guys. Puppets. Perfect. <laughs> got it. Okay. Thank you. And so that, are the, that south side has got buildings. It is the building that they were a part of. Cool. And yeah. so they came out of some doors. Geographically, okay. put me wherever is most uh, convenient for you guys, for whoever is before me in initiative. Okay. Are the two <laughs> hellhounds near each other? Uh, no. One of them has gone after uh, Painkiller, and the other one is still tormenting the Night's Watch. And, like, two of their friends are dead, and they're like, oh, God! And they got their guns out, and they're, prob they're probably going to shoot. Who knows? They might run. They probably won't run. Don't run, you pussies! Revenge is on the line. Okay. Reputation is on the line. Do you... Okay. I need to um, look up the area of effect real quick, because that's going to um, affect how much force I use. Because uh, the more force you use, the bigger it is. Right. Woo! If you make it too big... Then it'll catch my allies. Right. And if you make it too small, it won't catch the bad guys. Yep. Area spells. All targets in the area of effect that you can see. The targets of the spell. That's that's great, kid. Can you tell me how to calculate how big it is? That's real fucking neato. Also it's real useless. Fucking, neato. fucking cool, but give me some useful shit. So. Shadowrun. Because either it's it's one meter or ten. 
That's a and I can't remember for this difference. Yeah, it is. It totally is. What happens. I think I'm supposed to see. I'm pretty sure that ice storm is a one meter per force. So we're gonna do a force three ice storm centered on the hellhound attacking our goons. All right, isn't ice storm from your special? Yes, it is. It is. Uh, street more ice storm. It's all good. It's on page 103. I got you. Uh, ice You're Storm, amazing. its range is... Low line of sight. Line of sight area. So I, I think it just grows by a meter per force. All right, cool. So um, what's your force at? Three. Okay. Um, yeah, you're only going to be able to catch one hound in it. Yep, that's fine. Are you going to also ice all of your goons? If they step into that three-foot area. That's what they're there for. Oh, does it keep happening? Oh, uh, yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, it keeps happening, right? Yes. It so doesn't uh, Its duration is... Wait, no, its duration is instant. So stop. Duration is instant, so it'll, it'll fade next round. Right. Noise. But it'll do a burst of ice damage and possibly cause the Hellhound to lose its footing. Right. Yes. Get it. So that they can just catch it in a hail of bullets and yeah. hopefully help us out a little bit. So, All the uh, pew pews. Let me get that in my magic stat. One, two, three, four, five, six. And Very cool. Very cool. Two ones, four sixes. So four hits. Okay. So it takes uh, four damage. Oh, okay. It makes us so cool. Uh, oh no wait it doesn't because that's the whole thing about magic you don't get to soak hey oh, fuck you um, <laughs> I know that being said, you're magic Jeff, bitch Jeff, you don't get Jeff's to soak weekly shit. goal of making Reynolds say fuck you <laughs> get to check off that little box Chatterbox's goal is to ooh, make ooh. as few people say fuck you as possible you should have like a, a, a counter for it uh, that being said, it does manage to keep its footing. Uh, okay. But it does Dang yip fool. in a way that hurts your mind. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, your, your, uh, your, your spirit guide is like, oh, come on, man. Why you gotta, why you gotta hurt the puppers? And you're like, I know, I know. I'm sorry. Uh, that being said, that's your round. Uh, oh, wait. Uh, for strange. Drain. It almost didn't keep its footing. Meet to beat. Whew. It like it's slipping. It's sliding. Two. Four. Uh, five hits. Five hits. Uh, uh, and you cast it at four. At four, four three. So. My bad. So that'll be a total of four. Yes. So you take no damage from drain. I'm learning how to do this, guys. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm so proud of you. Just some ice spears show up on the ground, shoot up from the little... As soon as it shoots up, Chatterbox is like, Oh, you making a fucking ice rink. I'm so proud of you. That being said, Chatterbox, it's your turn. Yay. I'm probably just going to shoot at a dog, as that seems like the most like logical thing to do. Which dog will you shoot at? The one ma mauling the Black Watch or the one mauling Painkiller? Well, I guess it just... It it's whichever side I'm on. Decided which like, I know we're on the east and west. So am I on east or west? Um, I'm gonna say you're on east. You guys cuddled your squishies. So... Is that where painkiller is? No, painkiller is on the opposite oh. side. But it doesn't really matter. You just shoot it. Oh, it can I just shoot the? Weapon. That's true. I always treat myself like a brawler because I give myself brawler skills, but I also give me. Gave myself pistol skills for this one situation. Uh, I'll just shoot at the thing that's 
fucking biting at painkiller. Sounds good. It's For sure. Fuck it. that. It's yeah, a, fucking a, leave my friend alone. It's a big dog. Like, it's, it's, uh, like, obviously, if you glitch, there's a chance you'll hurt painkiller, but, like, it's, it's Don't really glitch. Good. I've got a But just shoot this fucking thing. So roll agility so, and pistols. Cool. Agility is four, and pistols is six, so I actually have pretty good stats. So yes, you use a simple we we uh, use a simple action, draw a gun. Simple action, shoot a gun. Cool. I'm gonna do that, then. I'm just gonna shoot at the pupper that's biting my friend. This one. But the ones that I got were good. Oh, and I got another six. Uh... Hit. Three six. Ooh. Uh, what's the damage of your weapon? Uh, let me check real quick. Uh, I believe it does. It says eight p. So that's physical. Oh. Yes. Poor, so. poor, poor Doge. Uh, what is the armor piercing value on your gun? Ooh. Let me double check. I think it's twelve, but let me check. Is that is AP armor piercing? Yes. Yep. Uh, negative one. Okay. So it only rolls seven. But it got three hits on seven dice somehow. Hey! Uh, so what was the damage again? Uh, eight, eight. P? Eight. So, uh, and you got yeah, three hits, P. right? Yeah. So that's one to hit, two over, ten, minus three is seven. Yay! Yay! I shot a dog. I don't know how to feel about that, but I sure did do it. You did, in fact, shoot a fucking dog. Hey, uh, Next, yay. the Black Watch go, and they're like, Oh my god! They killed Panther! They killed Oh Freddy! my god, keep your shit together, you fucking pussy! Uh, they draw and fire at the dog that is currently slip sliding on ice. Uh, that is yipping and growling. Uh, I should mention, this is all very, very noisy. Oh, of course. Of course. Um, hey. Although, I think I have a... I think I have something on my gun that snuffs, but I should check. Machine pistols are still pistols, am I right? Yep. Uh, um, JK, I just have a concealer. For some reason, I thought it was something that made it... But I lied. I won't lie to you again. Oh, baby Jesus. Okay, so one of them... Hits, <laughs> baby Jesus. So, like, one of them is freaking out and, like, uh, fires a three-shot burst at this thing and then drops his fucking gun like an idiot. Um, and the dog rolls He tried. Sword. He tried. He's trying so hard, man. Uh, and the dog soaks uh, a lot, but not enough. Yes! Um, and then the second one a lot. blows this thing the fuck away. Holy fuck. Uh, it's nice. The, uh, the, uh, it, it kills the two humans, and so the orc and the elf are left, and the elf drops Jesus. his gun, and the orc, like, just bears down on this thing, and, like, from outside the ice storm, shoves this gun in this thing's face, because it can't, like, it can't, what are you gonna do? And yeah. Blows its head to pieces. Yeah. I mean, like, Nicely all, done. all rose fuck soak, yeah. doesn't matter. The ganger got six hits, and the gun does five damage. Hell so yeah! Nice, seven, nice, nice. We're talking seven physical. This dog has already taken um, enough. Yeah, th this dog is in maximum overflow. This is nine plus seven. Six, this thing takes sixteen physical and is fucking dead. Take it, take it, bitch. Uh, Hellhound I mean, one the dog. is uh, the toast female the dog. Most. I'm sorry. This is a Hellhound. Okay, so Hellhound 1 is dead. Yes. Woo! Goodbye. Good job, team. Most. I'll just keep adding more initiative counters on it to just be like, nope, nope, skip, s skip over it. It's, it's dead now. Spread, Jim. She uh, gone. She Black gone, Watch Felicia. Strike. Mm, bye, Felicia. And then there is the other Hellhound, which is uh, attacking Painkiller. Ah, oh, PK! Oh, God! And it's like, oh, oh no! What? No! Kill friend. Kill them. Oh, no. Um, once again, I can't use the fire breath because reason. I already used it. Uh, Alright. Uh, Painkiller. 
Uh, roll that beautiful soak footage. All right. Pink Hopefully, <sighs> this is better than last soak. I believe in you. Oh, wait. Uh, do I take wound penalties for soak? No. You never no. take okay. wound penalties on, like, dying better. <laughs> <laughs> what that I could. Five successes. Uh... Yeah. Okay. Uh, you take three more physical damage as it bites the shit out of you again. Uh, again. Again. No, no. Wait, did you say five or four? Five. Oh, two physical. Okay. Ooh. Um, initiative marches on. Painkiller, you finally get a turn. Yay! Yay! All right. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Okay. Oh no. What do you mean oh no? I mean I I I try and shoot this dog and I got three ones and no successes. <laughs> oh! oh no Do you wanna do you wanna spend an edge to turn this critical glitch into a glitch so you don't mm. blow your leg off? Maybe. Yes please. Well, how many how many how, how many dice did you have in your pool? Seven. Oh it doesn't matter, you didn't get any hits, so yeah. So you, you spend uh, you spin an edge, uh, and you're like, oh shit, I'm gonna shoot myself in the leg. And you're like, I need those. Uh, those were expensive! Right, and like, this is gonna be, like, you can see it coming, like, the way you're falling over because of how this thing is, like, biting you. Like, you are going to fi film forward, and as your arm drops down, you're going to blow off your kneecap, and did you know that your knee is the major hinge for your lower leg? I did know that. It, you're correct. Um, it's really <laughs> unfortunate. So, Listen, my mom has you. two master's degrees in biology, and I <laughs> did know that. So <laughs> instead of holding on to the gun, you drop it. Um, and you, you drop it and get dragged onto your front as this thing is still mangling your arm. Uh, your defiance goes off, uh, but thankfully it doesn't seem to hit anything. Whew. That could have gone so much worse. So much worse. Oh my goodness. Good thing you got a leg. I'm proud of you. you kept Ooh. a leg on. Uh, and Farsight, your turn. Excellent. All right. I'm just going to take a shot at the puppy that's left. Sounds good. <laughs> Let's see what I get. I have like, uh, and zero hits. Anyone? Yes, one one. And what's uh, your pool? Uh, two. I have one skill and one agility. Which means that one one is half of your pool. Which means this is a critical glitch. Would you like no! to spend an edge no. to downgrade this critical glitch into a regular glitch? How bad could it be? A critical glitch means I imagine the worst thing that could possibly happen. You know what? I choose life. I, 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 the edge. <laughs> I choose life. <laughs> you, you, you spend an edge. Uh, you never were a gun master, Farsight, and so you you go to fire and you accidentally eject your magazine. <laughs> oh, that, what a relief! <laughs> like you're, you're like okay, thumb is the trigger finger, just like in video games. Wait a minute, and just and you just drop the magazine right the fuck out the gun. Big fancy gun, magazine on the floor. Figures. <laughs> <laughs> Havoc! Shit, these guys are just not... not. <laughs> they're having some difficulties. We are um, really struggling. We are, I'm gonna try to... <laughs> Y'all are on the struggle bus right now. <laughs> choo choo! Alright, uh, let me open up. Where's, where's the fucking lightning bolt? Hey! Who likes electricity? Everyone does! <laughs> Hopefully hellhounds don't resist it. I'm gonna shoot a four five lightning bolt at this pupper. Jesus Christ! It's like someone's got to take care of this because we sure can't. Roll yeah. It. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
Oh, please don't glitch. Please don't glitch. Okay, good. Two ones, three hits. <laughs> Sounds good. You zap this thing. Um, so how much, how hard do you zap it? Or is it just uh, hits as damage? Yeah, hits as damage, I believe. Okay. Uh, so roll that beautiful resist drain, and this thing takes three okay. physical, which fills up its physical... Five minus three. Um, minus three which minus fills two. up its condition... Oh, shit, no, it has a greater... Oh, wait, no, never mind. Nope, nope, it's still, it's still alive! Oh, fuck! I tried! The rest is up to you! Quick, Chatterbox, shoot it! Shoot her! Oh, Free shit. on drain. Chatterbox ran to the bathroom. Oh god, we're all gonna die. Ah! <laughs> nah, I'm just messing with you. She'll probably finish it off when she comes back. So drain is five minus three, so two. And I rolled three. What was that one? One stun damage? Am I doing my math? Run that math by me one more time. Uh, force minus three for lightning bolt, so five minus three is two, and I rolled three hits. So you take nothing. Holy fuck. What the sh- well What? Done. <laughs> I was- I must have been doing my math real bad in that first fight, because- No, you were just rolling low. Oh, okay. You were like, yeah, I got three hits to resist drain. I'm like, well, that means you take two. I was like, that sounds fucking sweet, kid. Also, like, some, some, some spells are different. Like, lightning bolts is, uh- uh, there are a lot of energy types to deal damage with, and they all have the mm -hmm. same drain. It's always force minus three. So you're supposed to be casting force four fireballs for days. Um, force four lightning bolts, like fucking whatever. Go hog wild, man. Who gives a shit? It's, uh, it's, that's free real estate. It's free fucking real estate, bro. Uh, but things start getting nastier when you start dealing with more powerful spells. And I don't mean spells that deal more damage. I mean spells that do weird shit. Shatter is... Oh, wait, no. It's Force Minus Six. We start getting into the Force Plus yeah, stuff. That's where... That's pretty crazy. Yeah, that's where shit starts getting bad. Like bad. Insecticide. That's the, pretty what the fuck interesting. Is that? Um, it's a specialized version of Slay, which is designed to target not insects but insect spirits yep they just dispels them mass yep um but like powerball for instance the drain mm. on that is just force um and it just causes a fucking explosion but like without the fire like like i mean an explosion is a boom um or a stun ball uh for when you don't want to kill people um, I'm trying to find Mind Probe. Or I have like, Mind Net. Or like your or Ice mind Storm, probe. for instance. That's a big one. Mwah. It is a big voice spell. Uh, but that's because it's two spells bolted together. Which is the entire reason why I took it. <laughs> exactly. Mind I was like, oh, I have one more spell slot and I need something that does damage so I can defend myself. Uh, mob control, mass animate, those are the big ones. Mob mind. I'm trying to think. Uh, oh man, what's the force on up on the chaos spell? Bugs. What am I? What am I looking at here, Bob? Uh, it's your turn. Please kill the hellhound oh. that is uh, killing painkiller. I absolutely will. Should I just shoot it? Cause I feel like I should just. Yo, you can just fucking shoot it, mate. I'll just fucking shoot it. Which means my accuracy plus my pistols, no, or just agility and pistols. Oh, gotcha. Your accuracy is the limit for the attack. Gotcha. Sorry, everybody had to wait for me, but also thanks everybody for waiting for me. Of course, we were just talking about spells and how cool they are. They are pretty fucking cool. Too bad I don't understand them at all. Okay, so yeah, uh, <laughs> one of my old characters, uh, one of his signature spells was Chaotic World. All around us are familiar. 
versus chaotic places. Um, I got four hits uh, and one one, so four hits. Sounds good. Uh, the the cool. heckin' pupper will roll a soak roll. It, I don't think it's good <laughs> for this world. It's not. Yeah, I'm not too worried yeah, about it. It does eight p, so yeah, plus three, so you deal uh eleven minus a, four, seven. A bunch. You deal seven damage to this dog, and you just shoot it in the gut, and it falls over. Oh, like, bye, yeah. pupper. I'm sorry. Like, it goes way over its condition monitor and just fucking dies. Oops. It, like, did I do like, that? It, yeah, Chatterbox it, pops it in the gut and goes, Oops, did I do that? Like, it coughs up some brimstone and falls over. Ow, no. But also, hey, we did it. I, I prime my arm out of its mouth. PK, you okay? Uh, PK, you are just not fucking okay. <laughs> you all right? Hold still. Don't 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 move that too much. Okay. Okay. Havoc, are you gonna yeah, try to roll on. a healing spell? Yes, I have heal single target. Painkiller. What's your es uh, What's your essence? <laughs> it's high. Six. Oh, there you go. No, no, your essence. Six. Six. No. Two mechanical Eight. legs. Oh, how? Do I didn't calculate that. That was just default. How do uh, two mechanical legs affect essence? I was like, I have, legs, two, yeah. I have two human legs and I have six essence. Uh, uh, so... Yeah, I got six too. Yeah. At most, uh, you're uh, the only one with essence loss. Hey, you have four uh, essence. Four? Okay. Yeah. I have four essence. Which actually means it hasn't fucked you up too bad. Not too bad. I mean, my identity isn't wrapped up in my legs. Not yet. Not Fucking yet. save. Uh, that being said, uh, painkiller. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, havoc. You're going to yeah. lose two dice on your healing roll. Oof. It's harder to heal painkiller with magic because there's not enough flesh to fix. Well. You think that would make it easier? Because <laughs> there's less places for the magic to go, but uh, no, it doesn't. I'm mostly just gonna try to keep you your blood inside of your blood. Remember, uh, um, uh, magic and technology do not mix. I guess I'm gonna have to expend a little more effort, aren't I? Certainly. Uh, four six. <laughs> He's bleeding a lot. He's losing all of his blood in his body. Well, remember, the force doesn't give you more dice. It just it gives, doesn't. It just increases your limit. <laughs> it just means that if I do manage to, oh wait, I can spend edge. Hey. hey. And when you, spend I would like edge, to spend edge, please. Do it. I get to reroll any sixes I get, right? Yes, your sixes explode. Oh, please explode! Ooh. Explode for me, daddy. <laughs> That's one that I get to reroll. <laughs> Please be another six. <laughs> Fuck. Um, that's a you total of one success. What? One what? hit. Sometimes it's just one of those nights, Reynolds. I rolled you four dice, and I got one six out of the four dice that I rerolled, and it was a two. Wait but wait, does doesn't he also get to reroll the um uh failures? No, that you no. can only do one Just of the other. Is... Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Uh, that being said, shouldn't you be rolling more than that? I don't have um. I just get to roll my magic stat for that. I don't have points in healing. I have detection and manipulation magic that I get to add my spell casting for. Oh. I can start doing medicine stuff when we get out of here, but until Still, then... Uh, uh, well, I mean, yeah, it closes the wound on your wrist, so you're no longer at risk for bleeding out. Yay! That's good. Every little bit counts. Ten. All right, big boy drain time. At least I get the numbers where it really matters. 
that'll be three hits on Trey. For a... Open up my other tab. Heal is a force minus four, so... Six minus four is two. I pass. <laughs> nice work. Hey, you're not bleeding out. Yay! Thanks, buddy. Ooh. Where where does You get a ping on your com link, you get an alert. Uh oh. Oh. Nice. Oh, right, right. Um you're you're good for now, right, PK? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go and take um, pictures of the, uh, the hellhounds. Harmless pictures? Normal, ordinary pictures of dead corpse hounds? The, la the passport lady asked me to. Oh, gotcha. It's That's proof. I also take pictures. Pictures are free. Chatterbox is posing, like, photobombing, like, not all of them, but just enough of the pictures. Just a couple. Uh, Just a couple. Uh, the two remaining... PK's accidentally uh, photobombing some of them. <laughs> <laughs> Chatterbox, Chatterbox is actively sneaking some photobombs in there that you have to like look for, like as a like it's a Where's Waldo situation, <laughs> <laughs> like a Where's Waldo, Where's Chatterbox, and she's like, ah, she's she's hiding in the corner, fucking ordering Parmesan pasta from that restaurant in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Jesus. So the two remaining Night's Watchmen look at each other and they're like, well. Don't be pussies! <laughs> no, they're, just like, they're, like, they're like, no, we're good, we're good. Just, you know. I guess we only have to hey. split our cuts. Two yeah, ways, fucking so. buckle up and man up. Nut up, boys. Nut up or shut up. Nut up, no, however you identify. Friends. Yeah, we're pretty Nut up, non gender discrimination terminology. Hey, you could That's probably... That's true, nutting uh, up is gender neutral. Yeah, you can nut up despite any gender. Fucking <laughs> nut up. <laughs> I think that's that's enough. Oh, okay, sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah, the two sorry, of them I'm just saying. very sadly, like, walk out of the alley and go back around the other side of the building. And you hear hey, guys, I think you could actually... Uh, they, have wa they have watched their friends die somewhere. today. I guess I'll let them, let them have Fair. a moment of grievance. <laughs> I reload my clip. You pick it up. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, thankfully, Farsight, everyone was so busy fighting the giant fucking dogs. You're correct. No one noticed. Perfect. <laughs> um, that being said, the Night Watchmen are now down from four to two. Um, and worse yet, Panther had the keys, but let's not worry about that. Uh, so, uh, mission accomplished, fission mailed, uh, Havoc, your native sin has a new quality. Ooh. Uh, Salishide passport status. You can now legally enter the actual Salishide. Ooh. That's pretty fucking rad. 